It was alright, it was a bit rainy, so there wasn't as many out as there usually would be, but um, we still enjoyed ourselves. Did you do a lot of these? Uh, yeah, we're doing quite a few festivals. In fact, we're doing another one today in North Holland. So we've got to dash off after this. So you rush it up there straight away? Yeah, yeah, straight away. So what kind of ambitions do you have then? Uh, the usual, world fame, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Ambition of life. Yeah, we, just, we just enjoy playing, to be honest, see where we can take it. And what do you think of the setup here? It's good, is it? I think it's great. It's, it's something for the family. You don't get many festivals like that. So. Shame we can't hang around to see it, actually. Yeah, we'd, we'd like to stay around and see a few more acts, but unfortunately we missed that. When everyone's lost, the battle is won With all these things that I've done Despite the weather, um, I think it's a good turnout. You know, it's nice to see that a lot of people from, from Cotton Club have turned up. Uh, Kinch, who opened the show for us, a very, very good band. I've seen them before in, uh, in Leeds, that's where they hail from. Uh, Oliver, who's performing at the moment as I talk. Um, a young gentleman from, from York again, he's done some gigs for us before. Uh, a completely different theme from, from Kinch. Uh, they're very funky and very soulful. Um, Oliver just an acoustic act, uh, so it's quite chilled and quite mellow. Um, and then Rule of Forty, who we've got coming on a little bit later, um, they'll get the crowd going again. You know, it's it's quite a good rock band, really. And uh, what about the weather then today? Does it uh, cause you a lot of problems? Or? No, no. I mean, I've been speaking to some of the organisers of Cop Carnival, and um, they say obviously, you know when you have a situation such as today, um, it means that you, um, it causes a little bit more aggro and a, a little bit more extra preparation. Um, of course one or two problems for, for York break dance, uh, but they're getting the stage sorted and dried out for the, for the dancers, uh, for the red shoe dancers. So overall I think it could have been a, a lot worse last year, um, after all the torrential rain, the field was actually flooded and we couldn't get on the field um, with the stage anyway. So, you know, we're one up on last year already.